Welcome back to Living 808. Special Olympics Hawaii is ready to make a splash with its latest fundraiser. You might know this one. It's called the Paradise Plunge. And this time around, there are many ways you can take the plunge. Say, yay, I took the plunge. I did it. Here to tell us all about this great fundraiser is Garica Venegas, Developing Coordinator for Special Olympics Hawaii. Thanks for being with us. Appreciate it. Hi, John. Thanks for having me. Tell me a little bit about this. It's the Polar Plunge fundraiser, and it's kind of been reinvented a little bit. Could you tell me a little bit more about how you guys have done that? Yeah, sure. So Special Olympics Hawaii has reinvented their traditional in-person Polar Plunge fundraiser to this newly created event called Paradise Plunge. So this new concept allows participants to safely continue to support our athletes while also enjoying and appreciating the beaches surrounding this beautiful place we get to call home. So participants get to share a video or photo of them taking a dip in the ocean. Uh, and this could be in any form of water activity like swimming, surfing, diving. And with the recent closure of beaches from gatherings, uh, we've actually, we're hoping that our participants are already avid water men and women who are already planning to hit the beach soon and can just capture some footage on their next session. Okay, so that begs the next question, then how can our viewers get involved? Yeah, so the Paradise Plunge is open to individuals, uh, families, student groups, and anyone who would like to support our athletes. And so uh, we are asking plungers to raise a minimum $100 donation uh, to receive their Paradise Plunge event shirt and to submit their footage. Uh, there's also a student rate that's $50 minimum donation uh, for students from elementary to college. And that doesn't mean that you have to raise the money yourself. You can reach out to your friends, families, your colleagues uh, to help you reach your goal. And so the submission for your footage, the deadline is August 30th. So uh, it's coming up pretty soon, everyone. So be sure uh, to sign up, or if you'd like to make a donation or for more information, you can visit sohawaii.org. How does the monies from this particular fundraiser go to benefit Special Olympics Hawaii? Yeah, so we've actually had to postpone and even cancel many critical fundraisers this year. So that's why every fundraiser now, like Paradise Plunge, is very important for us to help ensure that we get our, our athletes uh, safely back onto the playing field when the time is right. So proceeds that we receive will help us to continue our virtual and online programs to help serve our athletes during uh, the time of the pandemic. And um, our athletes are actually considered a vulnerable population. So uh, our proceeds will help ensure that over 3,400 children and adults with intellectual disabilities will be able to return to in-person sports uh, safely and with the proper protective equipment uh, necessary when the time is right. Can you, I think that's so, so awesome, by the way, um, and, and much <laughs> needed. But uh, can you tell me a little bit more on what initiative Special Olympics Hawaii offers during this time? Yeah, so our Special Olympics staff has been working really hard to continue to stay in close contact with our athletes and help keep them engaged, active, and fit during this time. So we have various programs like our Zoom workouts, uh, fitness challenges, and even our weekly virtual dances are a big hit with our athletes. Um, so we've uh, had to even transition some of our many uh, signature fundraiser events, so like Cheer for Champions and the Polar Plunge, so that they can be online and still participate, as well as our Okake Classic uh, to be online for our athletes to, to be able to participate as well. That sounds like so much fun, and thank you for all that you do. Can you, can you tell me how our viewers can find out more information uh, on Special Olympics Hawaii? I know you mentioned the, the website, but could you do it again for me? Sure. So if you want to get more information on Special Olympics Hawaii, you can visit our website at sohawaii.org or you can follow us on Twitter and Instagram at sohawaii and uh, on our Facebook at Special Olympics Hawaii. Information that we will surely have on our website, kh12.com, shortly after the show. Thank you so much for all that you do and for being with us here on Living It Wait. I appreciate it. Thanks so much, John. I appreciate it as well. They're making some changes. They're doing it all for the better, and I think it's for a great cause.
Special Olympus, and they always do the creative events. You know, they do the over the edge repelling normally too. So definitely getting some visual fun fundraisers for such a great cause. We know how much the sports and the athletics physicality means to these athletes who are very special. I, and they are very, they're some very, very good athletes. Uh, I've been able to watch a couple of uh, different uh, in years past watch a couple mm -hmm. of different events, especially in the track, and man, oh man, wow, just amazing. Yeah, so we'll post that link and uh, support Special Olympics Hawaii. You can get in the water, do something for the Paradise Plunge, right? Yeah. <laughs> 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 the Polar Plunge? I, I've yeah. actually never done the Polar Plunge. So the Paradise Plunge, maybe. Maybe we'll, we'll okay. see. We'll see if, we, if I get invited. I don't know. I might, okay. actually, I might actually fall into the water and then knock it all out. You, you never know. <laughs> 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 All right, let's